What's up guys? Welcome back to another vlog. I was about to say podcast. Bruh. Today we actually just got back from our six month baby appointment. And mm -hmm. it was so lame. All they do is show the heartbeat. I wanted to see her. But now we are getting breakfast because we need to get some energy for Christmas shopping. Did we do it last year? Yes. But it was very poorly done. I remember you no, know, it wasn't like it wasn't Christmassy now yes, as it usually we're does. We're looking for vlogmas. No, but remember how you decorated just green and white? That was lame, babe. This that year because we have a toddler but he's scared of the Grinch so <laughs> we have to make it cute we have to make it aesthetic I want the house to be like this is a Christmas house this is a house that likes to have fun and also Jonathan is doing Christmas lights outside of the house for the first for the time, first time ever so yeah. we have to get those and get oh, them up before it that. snows yeah usually I only buy the projector that like shows the whole house but this time we're gonna put lights up guys okay and we're gonna go hard with the decorations we're gonna try not to break the budget you know no that that's what we're going to Marshall's <laughs> and Dollar Tree. Tyler Peep, guys, literally our favorite breakfast restaurant because Blanca did such a good job at her appointment. She's doing such a great job creating a baby. So this is her reward. We had a little bit of breakfast, but now we are at Marshall's. Here, I kind of want to look for like cozy things, like pillows and blankets for the okay. living room. And then, because I think like the tree decorations, we can probably find those in bulk like at Hobby Lobby, you know? Okay. And they usually have cells there too, so it, it's nice to go there. But here we're gonna look for the cozy items. Okay, let's Hopefully go. Hopefully there's some Mickey items. Oh, I don't I thought they were empty. No. Not that they, they came they with, with Oh, that one's cute. We can dump it out and put what we want, no? Oh, no, they're not the vibe. I don't like it. It doesn't have to be the whole theme, but what is that? Measuring? Oh, yeah. Those would break, I feel like. Really quick. We need a new one anyway. Ooh, and it's seven bucks. Oh, I really want bugs. Because since we're doing at home coffee now. Ooh. Oh my god, he literally does. That's huge. What the heck? Yeah, that one's cute. This one's aesthetic. Oh, this Oh, that's a really yeah. yeah, those two. Maybe one more. This one? Why one more? Because Christmas lasts a long time. That's so true. Oh, we already have a Santa. Oh, we do? <laughs> oh my god, that one smells like so wackles. What are you going for? In the kitchen? No, for the shelves so in the living room. Pues uno que diga Merry Christmas. Oh, that one's cute. Oh, this one's so cute. Oh. Look at that. That one's cool. It's a cat. It literally counted down. Oh. It's a Spider Man. He's definitely just going to want to play with Woody. you. Mmm. That oh, one's so. Oh, oh. And it's a wiener dog. Oh, we should buy one of these and put also in China. Ew, but it's really cute. Uh, oh, they gave me the chills. No, I kind of like that one. 50 bucks? Oh my god, baby, this one's sick. I think they just put their letters in there, right? Yeah. <laughs> and how do you get them out? Oh, this one's cute. No, oh, that dog looks kind of messed up, though. But is this for the. It's for inside, no? Yeah, like by the. That one's cute. Stufa? Yeah, that one is cute. How much? 25 bucks, not bad because it's pretty big. Well, there's this one too for the kitchen. Oh, that's way better. How? No. Because that one's waterproof and spill proof. So, like, no matter what, it's kind of ugly. Guys, which one? That one or that one? It's because on camera, this one looks good. <laughs> but, look, do you see how, like, it has spots? Yeah. This looks dirty. Okay. <gasps> that's literally oh, perfect. Look at how cute. Oh, those are cute. I need this, this tela, but Christmas spikes. But why do you have to have that one? Because this one is durable and it's warm, and it doesn't get static. This like one's these. nice. Do you know how the couches get staticky? This is just bigger, much less. But these, on the other hand, like the Mickey Mouse one. That I have. Yeah, guys, we were about to leave and look what we got. Who found it? 
you did. It's like a nacimiento, but they're like kids. So cute for the shelves. The hard part is gonna be making Frank or not play with them. <laughs> what did I say? All right, guys, we are out of Marshalls, our first store. Mm -hmm. It was $168. It would have been $178 because I had a $10 certificate, so. We're gonna keep updating you guys with how much everything costs that way, you know? It's just be like a little fun game, see how much we spend at the end of our whole decoration one. What's our budget? I wanna say $500. Yeah, like no more than $500. Yeah. Is that too much? No, no, that $500, but it includes the lights. Yeah, everything. The lights outside and the ornaments, which are pretty. I know lights are pricey, so. <gasps> they are pricey. So let's just keep it under $500, okay? Yeah. That'll be our budget. So $168. And I have, I have one more certificate, so we're gonna hit Home Goods and TJ Maxx to see if we find anything over there, too. Now on our way to Target. Okay, we made it to Target and we're not here to holiday shop actually. We came here yesterday because we needed a bunch of things. And I don't know who it was or what happened, but we forgot a bag here. So I just came with the receipt and I'm gonna hopefully be like, hey, we left this bag here. Do you guys have it or can we just re get the items? They let me do it once, I don't know if they'll let me do it again. Yeah. But yeah, we literally forgot like eighty dollars worth of things. Yeah. So hopefully guys guess what luck was on our side today and they had our bag full of things that we forgot thankfully we got that and then we might have added four more things to the you part. know you can never leave target without getting something yeah so we just got a few things but we'll show you guys in the fall but what's next babe where we're going well i'm trying to convince blanca at home is right next to us it's basically for those that don't know what at home is it's like a gucci big lots <laughs> literally it's just so overpriced but it's really cute it is very cute yeah let's go 9.99 for the whole thing of ornaments they're not gonna get me with this one but they're not that cute i think it's these are the ones no one wants guys who if you do this theme please tag someone that you know in the comments so i can report them to the fbi whoa We're not getting into true this year, guys. Honestly, the Home Depot viral TikTok treat almost got me, but we just got a new one last year, right? Yeah. Last year. So we're just gonna stick to the old. All right, guys, also comment down below what theme you guys are going for. And if you switch every year or do you just keep the same theme every year? Last year, as you guys know, I let Blanca take care of it and she disappointed me because she did green, just green. And it was so aesthetic and I would wake up so happy every day because it was beautiful. Just green and wood. I was like, heck no, babe, I'm sorry, let me take over. You know what Noemi told me the other day? She was like, it's so surprising to me how much control you let Jonathan take of things. And today I'm realizing that it is because I told them, okay, baby, you can decorate this year. And we literally have Mickey Mouse, Gingerbread, Rudolph the Red-Nosed Ranger, Santa, and everything, which is going to be like Christmas threw up in our house. Yeah. But if but it makes you happy, it's okay. I truly think these are the years you remember, though. Oh, we'll yes. remember yours for being funny, but... <laughs> Guys, I just saw a black Christmas tree, and now a black guest mat or floor mat. I don't know what those are called. Anyone do a black theme? That's crazy if you do. I think I found a better one than the one at Marshall. My it's bad. more aesthetic. He sees you when you're snacking. Oh, that's creepy. Who? He? Who's he? The gingerbread. No, one. Santa. Oh, well, yeah. Are you snacking good or bad so he cannot bring you gifts? So you got to be on a diet to get gifts? I don't know. At home's giving cheap vibes. Look at this. This is cheap. This isn't glass. It's plastic. I got uh, one of those case suction cup things, so... <laughs> Where'd you put it? You can walk anywhere. Yeah, at home's is... It's not giving, but I think maybe it's a little early. Itano le echan ganas. All the cute stuff's in the middle, though. Let's go over here. Oh, something does smell good right there. What is that? Oh, it's this. You sure? Yeah. Se ponen mis closets. Oh, my God. Look. This is Crumpus vibes. This is Crumpus vibes, if you remember the movie. So these are the ladies that like to do turquoise. Oh. Rich ladies. I like the, I would do like a polar bear theme one day when you... Babe, I yeah, don't want to get in line for just that. But it smells really good. Okay, let's go. Oh, look at this guy. He okay. definitely is not going on Santa's good list. He looks like he just smoked that. I'm only a morning person on December 21st. Or, 
fifth. Sorry, my ADHD. Dang, it's not giving. Look at the mugs here at at home and then the ones at Marshall's. I definitely, mm -mm. So We're leaving at home with nothing because the lines were too long. Where are we going now? Now we're going to Home Depot. Where is Let's it? try to get Christmas lights. The lighting sucks, but we are now at Home Depot. We're gonna look for our Christmas lights and this is an investment, don't you think? Cause you're gonna use them for like the next five years. Yeah. Also, si se nos pega un inflatable or two, <laughs> cause I'm an inflatable boy. We didn't do an add the money at Target. Oh yeah, how much was it? $18. What? I can't do math. I can't do that. Uh, one. We'll put it on the screen. 186. What style you want? I don't even know what style I want. Well, I said these and you were like, oh, ew, no. Absolutely not. They're gonna be white. <laughs> Let's go look at the inflatables. <laughs> look, this is the one that Jonathan did last year. And I never put it up. <laughs> <laughs> I think the Home Depot by our house is better, babe. Yeah, way better. This one sucks. Yeah, this one's kind of <laughs> me. <laughs> Flop. Flop. What the hell is that? <laughs> Franco was <laughs> That is actually cool, but where do you even put that? Outside? <laughs> well, that was a major flop. You know what it is, though? I think that it's because we're so used to our stores over there. Maybe. Like, you already know where everything is. That's the only thing that Franco's into right now, so we're just... You know, going with his vibes. It is now 6, 10, and we made it to Home Goods and TJ Maxx. And we're gonna see what we find. Hopefully, we find the last things that we're looking for because then we would only have to focus on the outside, which are the lights and the inflatables. So let's go. Say what's up to the vlog. Yeah, I'm putting it. Okay, babe, what are we looking for? We're looking for a blanket and then a like bathroom set for the guest bathroom downstairs. Hey, Nino. What's up guys, it's the next day. Sorry for not letting you know, but we're outside Home Depot. Yeah, it's day two of shopping. Hopefully we get what we want this time. Honestly, Home Goods and TJ Maxx was such a flop. I didn't find not even one thing that I liked. We went to a store next to Home Goods, which is called Sierra. Mm -hmm. It's like a outdoors clothing. Yeah. And we bought Franco some snow boots his first pair of snow boots ever and they're so cute so that's literally all the shopping we got done last night so we went for no reason basically. so i guess that doesn't change the total let's go and see if we find our first christmas lights ever of our life ever wow in our family that's crazy and i'm gonna leave them on until i know i'm more may you can't be that <laughs> person I have a Donald. Do you want to get Donald? Yeah, I feel like Donald. Too. I think it could be a change of a little bit. All right, guys. So we ended up going with these, but when you press the button, they actually look kind of cool and it's different. I've never really seen houses. These right here, guys. Press it. Oh, for oh. Oh, shit. That is, it looks like it's snow. You think I broke them? Yeah, don't. Leave those two in there. there's no more. Yeah, there is in the back. No, it's fine. No, babe, yes, they did. Oh my God. Hey, if you guys don't know something, don't know something about Jonathan, it's like he is CEO of Break. How many are we going to get? Six. So. They didn't break, babe. They're plastic. It's not like they're actually glass. I'm off. You're for sure a Mexican mom, you know? No, they should be funny. Yeah, they're plastic. Wait. They're not glass. All right, guys, we're doing a budget check real quick. I was telling Jonathan that we're going over the budget because they're $32.90 something a piece. So if I do 33 times 6 boxes, oh shit. It's $198, but we've only spent $180. Yeah. <sighs> Plus this know. one. Uh, how much is that one? This is for the tree guys in the front. You think this is enough? How much are they? $200? 58 feet. We only have $100 to spend on ornaments. 
no inflatable. No, babe, you didn't even put the inflatable. <laughs> I think it was 35 if you run it up. So, we have to go to a big lot. <laughs> <laughs> okay, babe, we're not gonna get arrested if we go over the budget. <laughs> I know. But, but yeah, I think, yeah, that's, we have to. Just... But we also, it's cause the, what I was thinking last night, I was like, I can just take out the box from last year. But the problem is that last year all the decorations are green yeah. you know so it's not gonna go we have a couple of wreaths that we've used and stuff but i think we should go to hobby lobby because they always have sales you sure you don't want to just get the ornaments right there no babe i promise you hobby lobby is the place to be okay all right guys we forgot something very important which is extensions 25 feet and it's 15 dollars Ooh, what about that keep the water on What is it? All right, I guess this four dollars. My dad's gonna be like, I never use. <laughs> Alright, babe, your girl math was not mathing. Wait, what happened? You went from 187. Oh, because we added the cord, the extension cord. Okay, $15. And then the Donald Duck was 35 But we put the 35 in the math. I don't it know. was 297 guys, so... 297 plus 186 <gasps> No! We have $17 left, guys. <gasps> babe, goodwill. <laughs> Good well ornaments, here we come. Guys, guess what? 50% off entire Christmas decor. So we find this little gingerbread house. Mmm, tacky. Do you like this? Do you like this one? Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. So should we do this one? Yeah. And this one, no? But like little ones? Four ninety nine for two? Yeah. You got me fluffed up. Six for six? Four ninety nine. Three for two. I like those more. And we're thinking long run. If you decor like this for Christmas, you should go on a list. We're gonna take the court, right? We're gonna put it on the tree. If we don't like it, we'll return. I don't like think you this. can return. You can. Oh, you didn't get the Santa one too. No, that one's tacky. Babe, who's tacky? It's a little toddler we're decorating for. <laughs> Not your Fashion Nova moms. These? Yeah. But it's only I like these, but they're more expensive and it's less, no? How much are they? $14.99, so $7.99? $15.98, damn, these are really cheap. How much? $15.98 for all of these. And those? Those are $14.99. That's 14 babe? You got oh, me- seven. We're gonna need both, so just put it in there. You're right, if it's more, then we'll just return What about these? Candy cane, man. How much? Talk to me $11 nice. $11.99. Oh, these are cutie. Merry Christmas. Yeah. That's cool because it's a candy cane, babe. Ah, yo no escojo nada. You <laughs> chose this thing. Babe, you know I'm biting my tongue, right? Why? This is too much for me. Like, I'm the minimalist Christmas queen. No, you're not. And you're the freaking Christmas threw up in my house. And you know why it is, guys? And it's the same thing with Halloween. It's because Jonathan never decorated for Christmas because you guys were never home. You know, mm -hmm. like, we were always in Mexico. So, and me, I've gone through all these stages my whole entire life. So I just wanted to be calm, cozy Christmas life. But... I compromise for you. No, you know what? What about these? The only thing my mom, because we were late to Mexico, she would decorate a very nice Christmas tree. <laughs> Everything else was bland, but I feel like that's why I want a cool Christmas tree because my mom's Christmas trees were really cool, babe. I remember. If you decorate like this for Christmas, hey, you're you honestly just need to grow up. <laughs> these are cute. Yeah, I'm gonna get a couple. $3.99, so $1.99. Let's see if this goes perfectly. This is what I thought we got. <laughs> so last year, I really wanted a flocked Christmas tree and Jonathan kept saying no, right? Whatever. So then 
this year, I don't know what happened that we just thought that we had gotten a flocked Christmas tree. And so this whole time we're like, well, we don't need too many ornaments because it's just flocked Christmas tree. And so I go and watch our video from last year. It's a regular Christmas tree. We got so this we one, show them. So we do have to compensate for But this is all we have. We got that one. So that's what we thought we had. Yeah. $2.99 for a nine foot is it tree. Pretty lit. Where 800 LEDs. Yeah, that's really good. With pine cones. This year, just be that. Next year, Franco's gonna be more aware. And our baby girl's gonna be here so we can go hard next year. Babe, how are we not gonna get this one? It literally would match the kitchen and you put it in the living room. Okay. And it's 50% off. Okay, get it. 27 bucks. Look, guys, this is Jonathan, okay? We'll, we'll be at home. Babe, we're not gonna spend a lot of money. We're just gonna do this. Blah, blah, blah. And then we're at the store and he's always like, Babe, how could we not get this one? And you guys were experiencing it first. <laughs> All right, if you decorate like this, Oh, look at this one. Your mom is definitely didn't raise you right. That one is cute. That one's way cuter than the one we got. Okay, I think we should get the dogs. This is uh, it doesn't match the aesthetic. This one. This one. This one. This one. This one. No. It matches our aesthetic. No, Maybe we're close. not that. We have the. No, we have we're the not that. What do you want? One that matches the like this on yeah. the stairs. Imagine this on the stairs. No, babe. These are timeless. We're gonna use these forever. <sighs> That's why I bought the ones last year. So they don't count towards the budget because they'll be spread out through 50 years. So divided. <laughs> 50? They're not gonna last that long. For the next dogs. Whose wife, guys? Look, I'm just going off the inspo. They look better in my head, honestly. <laughs> <gasps> oh my god look at this one franco would freak out babe it's oh. the nacimiento but it has all the animals it's a nacimiento and animals can this one go in the back where in the back house well this is for inside bubs oh so can we put it in the kitchen <laughs> no honey babe babe it's because listen to yourself like this oh in the garage in the garage in the garage wait how much is that 25 bucks so 15 so 12 and the 50 Un día voy a decorar como yo quiera. All right, we had seventeen dollars remaining, <laughs> and I think we're at two hundred. But no pasa nada. All right, guys, we're gonna show you what we got today. Here's our little haul. We are gonna start off with Target because it's where we got the least amount. The first thing we got this Santa mug for my dad, and then we got this for my mom. So we got them two mugs. This one just says Feliz Navidad, and then we wanted soap dispensers that just were soap dispensers that didn't have soap because the soap smell kind of bad. So we got this one. Close is coming. A Christmas tree. Okay, Jonathan's gonna do the Hobby Lobby haul because he picked everything out. Not really. I got this pillow because it matches our gingerbread theme. We have three themes. We have gingerbread, Mickey Mouse, and candy. candy. I just got a small tree skirt for our little Christmas tree. This little gingerbread. Oh, I think this one's the one that's going on the desk room, right? Mm -hmm. The pups, some socks, because they don't have any. And these are timeless. Socks? Well, Stockings. Stockings. I think I did a really good job with the theme of the ornaments of the Christmas tree. Box number one. These are the medium. And then we got like the cool ones, cool design ones, I guess. We got some candy canes. Jonathan really wanted some candy canes this year, so we got one, we got two, four, and six. These will only be going in the front of the tree box today. Oh yeah, I got a little, what are they called? Like a tree ribbon? And it's candy cane. How cute, I forgot about this. And then lastly, we got these little things that you just put in there. Yeah. At Marshall's, we caught some of the cozy things. So we got our couch blanket. So this is literally the aesthetic. Look how cute it is. So we got this like butter keeper with Keep a little scoop. Yeah, because you're supposed to put butter and then you cut it. I thought it was for cookies. We got a little Christmas pan because we are in our Cinnabon era, so we cook Cinnabons all the time. <gasps> this is what I'm excited about. We got our nativity set. This is gonna go on our shelf. Look at how cute. It's like a little baby kid messing in. We got a spoon holder. Rudolph the Red Nose. Right now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and the last thing we got a candle. 
Yay, and it smells really good. Mmm, what is it? What did it go? Okay. Mmm. Yeah. We got our kitchen mats. Gingerbread bean. Okay, what? Mm. Es para que lo pongamos en la cocina, ¿ok? Se pueden quebrar. ¿Te gusta? Ok, ahorita lo vamos a poner allá. ¿Te gusta un Sí. ¿Qué es este? ¿Cómo lo hace? Ma. Me. Ba. Ma. Mickey Mouse. ¿Quién es? Mouse. Mickey. Pity. Y Winnie. Muy bien. And then we'll show you these guys. We already set these up, empty boxes. We got an outdoor Mickey Mouse at Walmart. We got these candy canes. We got this North Pole inflatable. And these bush lights. Yay! It's safe to say that we didn't stick to our $500 budget. I'm gonna try to find and put all these clips when I edit it, but I think it's like 700. 750 Because bucks. we had 17 bucks left before we went to Hobby Lobby and we spent what, 180? And then we did a last minute, last night trip. To Walmart. To Walmart. And we spent like two, wait, there were some things in there that yeah. weren't. So it was like, like 180 probably too in life so yeah i'd say close to 700 bucks which we're not proud of guys but we do see these as a long-term investment i think the ornaments we're going to use for a long time the christmas yeah. Okay, Franco is gonna come outside and look at the lights. We weren't able to find Mickey Mouse, I think I told you guys. So he'll see just the beginning of the decorations. Estás listo para verlos, papá? Sí. Sí. Wow. ¿Qué es? ¿Qué es? ¿Quién es? Pato. El pato, mira las luces de la casa. Es que están nada más. Mira arriba. Mira arriba. Están más opacas que otros, ¿no? ¿Cómo? ¿Qué piensas? ¿Te gusta? Lo largas, como que están más ¿Sí? opacas que otros, porque es el. Messi. <risa> Dile hola. Hola. Ay, amor. Wow, guys, they're so freaking cute. Do you feel proud, babe? Yeah, for First holding the year. ladder. <laughs> First year. Oh, you meant about. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We need to go get Mickey Mouse and all his friends. Oh. Daisy? Daisy? No está Daisy, mi amor. Vamos a ir a buscarla, ¿ok?
All right, guys, we got my suegro set up. Mickey and the North Pole. <laughs> now we bought these, our very first also bush lights. So as you can tell, got a few bushes right there that these will match those. So I'm really excited. 